Good morning reception and welcome to Tuesday's Maths Learning. So yesterday we talked about our learning for this week was going to be talking about length, okay? How long or short or longer or shorter or longest or shortest, okay? So they're all the terms, the math terms that we're going to be using this week for our learning. Now for today's activity, okay? So yesterday you had to order, according to their length, five of your toys. Well, today what I'd like you to do is we're going to up that number, okay? We are going to have 10 wiggly worms, okay, of different lengths. Now you can make your wiggly worms however you want to. Your grown up could cut them out for you in various different lengths, or you could do what Mrs. Sharp's done, I've got wiggly worms made of string, okay? So 10 wiggly worms. Now let's have a little look. Can you see which of my wiggly worms is the longest? Clap if you think it's this little wiggly worm. Clap if you think it's this little wiggly worm. Well done, this is my longest wiggly worm. He's very wiggly, isn't he? Okay, let's have a little look. Oh, now have a little look. Now this time we're going to see which one's the shortest wiggly worm. The shortest, okay? Clap is the, if you think it's this wiggly worm that's the shortest. Clap if you think it's this wiggly worm that's the shortest. Yay, it's this little wiggly worm that's the shortest, little wiggler. Okay, so if you cut up bits of string, 10 pieces of string into various different lengths, okay, and then I'd like you to order them longest to shortest, okay, and remember, then I want you to describe and talk to your grown-up about each of those different uh, wiggly worms and describing them using those terms we use, longest, shortest, longer, shorter, long, short, Okay, wonderful. So that's your activity for today. You can even, if you wanted to, make some Play-Doh and make Play-Doh wiggly worms. Um, but that's up to you. Okay, all right, I shall see you tomorrow. Bye.